Hello YouTube, this is iTaxTutorials11 and today I'm going to show you how to uh, make an explosion using Windows Movie Maker. So there's two links in the description box below and these are the links you would need. So the first link is movies.blainsville.com and then you click this re re-released you click that and then okay it shows you here so to make the explosion you need this effect and you have to download multiple files so now if you have a Windows, six, uh, Windows Movie Maker 64 bit you download that and if you have 32 bit you download that if you have XP you download that it's all the same. So you need. Uh, I think you need Windows Movie Maker 6 for this, cause I downloaded Windows Movie Maker 6, cause on Windows 7, uh, Windows Live Movie Maker comes the newest one. So I'm 32 bit, so you have to download these two folders right there. You're gonna click it. It's gonna take you to another place. You select your language and then you click download now you download the first file okay now this is the first file you download now I'm not gonna save this because I already saved it and I already have it and I installed it so you should start with this first you should go in order so you you click that do it you know run it do anything you want you know fin when you finish installation you should go to this second one the second one is this one right there you click it and then um yeah there it is okay and then you click for the stable release for 32 bit if you have 64 then use 64 but i have 32 but see this one only works with DirectX uh, I told you just two seconds ago that you should download DirectX before this so you download the 32-bit one and when you're done doing that uh, install it and then when you're done you don't need to do anything extract files nothing you just install it, click finish that's all now we're done with this we click you can just uh, close this file and then there's this it's called stubs effect explosion package now you click download now and then you gotta wait 142 seconds it's normally 80 seconds or 90 seconds but I download this more than once so I'm not gonna wait 134 seconds now so when you when you finish downloading it okay it's gonna be like that on a zip file so I'm gonna show in folder okay so let's you, you can just drag this to your desktop and then okay wait okay there it is you'll just drag it to your desktop I know it's a zip file so there it is stubs effect effects so you right click and you need WinRAR for this so if you want to know how to download WinRAR first I'm going to show you how to download Windows Movie Maker 6.0 so you down click right down download Windows Movie 6.0 for Windows 7. You click this one. Okay, then you, you see. Now you keep on going down, and then you're gonna click this one. Download. Then it's gonna start downloading, and you can install it. The second program you're gonna need is WinRAR. 
I think everybody has WinRAR, but you know, for beginners, I'm just gonna show you how to download WinRAR again. Cause some people are idiots; they don't know how to download WinRAR and shit. So just go to 32 bit, and then just click download. Okay, so we're done with that. Okay, and now we're gonna right click extract we're gonna extract it right here this thing will come called explosion package yeah it'll take you about 15 seconds so we're gonna click explosive explosion package and then there's gonna be two files one is a sound file and one is a video file now you click the video file and then it's gonna there's this video is gonna be about fifteen seconds for three different positions the front, the right, and the left. This that's the front and that's the right and that's your left. So now I'm going to show you, um, for example, I'm going to, I'm just going to finish this thing. So now we're going to open Windows Movie Maker 2.6. Where is it? I think it's this. Yeah, there it is. So I'm going to import videos. Um, you're going to put this import video. And then you're gonna go to videos. I'm gonna just go here, you know. Shit, look. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, there it is. Okay. I'm gonna show you the whole entire video. So, just gonna put that there. Then we're gonna put that there. And we're gonna put this after. After we edit the video. So now, my position, I, j I, st I jump from the right. So the explosion is going to come from the right. Now to cut it, you have to play it. And you pause it right before it begins. You go to clip, trip, trim, beginning. And then you keep it for a while. until the next recording happens so like that then you're gonna go clip and okay now I'm just gonna edit this video just for a second okay now this is what I edited and this is how it's gonna look like without the special effects okay so now we downloaded something it's called this when you download those both files, it'll come to the transitions automatically. You don't have to do anything for it. You just click that, and then you're going to drag it between the two videos. Yep, and now this is, this is what happens. See? So I'm going to put it, I'm going to put this a little bit closer, like that okay then we need the audio we're just gonna go to audio import and then we're gonna click that when we need it so let's see when does it start okay there perfect so it starts like this I'm just gonna, you know, take my voice for a second. I just wanna record the system audio. Oh no, I can't do that. Fuck. Okay, whatever. So, so you can move the audio like this. It depends where your explosion starts. And if you start from the left side, you can do the left side. If you just jump from, from the camera, like on top of it, you can do that. So, this is the end of the video. It's simple. So thanks for watching and subscribe.